why meditation is necessary from the medical sciences point of view. From the time of the birth till death the heart works continuously. Every day the heart pumps 7000 liters of blood, of which 70% blood is pumped to the brain and the remaining 30% to the rest of body. How does the heart work so efficiently and effectively? Heart works effectively because it follows a discipline. In normal conditions the heart takes 0.3 sex to contract systole and 0.5 sex to relax. Diastrally. So, 0.3 plus 0.5 equals 0.8 sex are required by the heart to complete one beat one cardiac cycle. That means in one minute, the heart beats 72 times which is considered as normal heartbeat. During the relaxing phase of 0.5 sex the impure blood travels through the lungs and becomes 100%. Pure. In some stressful conditions, the body demands more blood in less time and in this situation the heart reduces the relaxing period of 0.5 sex to 0.4 sex. Thus, in this case the heart beats 82 times in one minute and only 80% of blood gets purified. On more and more demand the relaxing time is further reduced to 0.3 sex and then only 60% of blood is purified. Imagine the consequences of the lesser oxygenated blood circulating in our arteries. Deep breathing is the key to ensure better oxygenation of the blood. Factors responsible for the activity of the brain 1. 25% to 30% is due to the diet we consume. 2. 70% to 75% is due to the emotions, attitudes, memories and other processes of the brain. Thus, to calm the brain and reduce the demand on the heart to pump more and more blood. Brain needs to be given a rest. Meditation is the most useful tool to calm an agitated mind. When we sit with eyes closed and meditate, the brain gets calmer, heart gets rested. Thus insulating us from the diseases of heart and brain. Meditation is the key to the real healing. Our ancestors taught us this thousands of years back. How many knows this real truth?